So good morning or good night, depending on where you are in the world. And welcome to another album review of The Shield Dude on a Couch. I'm your host, Hector. And today we're going to talk about the brand new album by the band Alcest. And it's called Les Chants de l'Aurore. I'm sorry for my French. <laughs> it's not my first language. So this means the, the songs of the dawn or dawn songs. And this is an album that, you know, it's like... Uh, 43 minutes it's I think it's like roughly like seven to eight tracks and it's you know Alcest is a band from France and they were started by Nietzsche if I said it correctly I'm sorry French couchers I still love you but yeah <laughs> you know uh, the band Nietzsche started the band and it's a band that plays black gay so they have black metal elements with more shoegaze, but as the albums have gone further on, they've gotten like more beautiful. And I would say more in the shoegaze type of like beautiful feel. Uh, you know, uh, they're really, they really seem more in a soothing town than, you know, like traditional black metal, black metal. And on this album, black metal is used more sparingly. I would say it's more of an ethereal shoegazy, uh, type of sound uh, and very like beautiful and serene at times so it's a record that uh, it's great for meditation like this is a record that you can put early in the morning and just like think about your life man uh, what choices are you making and this record is great for that if you are going out at night and driving no this is not the record that you should play if you're sleepy but yeah all jokes aside, you know, Alces is a band that uh, I've been following for a few years. The first time I listened to the name was in 2011, and it was because they were actually playing in Puerto Rico. And I didn't know the band at that point, and I missed that show. And until this day, I'm like, oh my God, I could have seen Alces live. And because I didn't know who they were, I did not go. So, yeah, stuff that happens. But going back to the record. So the record... Like I say, it's very beautiful. It's obviously the, the lyrics are in French, but to me, you don't have to know French to understand this record. For example, I know a few words in French. Bonjour, oui, et l'attention s'il vous plaît, which means, please bring me the check. But none of those words are on this record, so I am screwed. <laughs> but jokes aside, you know, you just get the Google Translate, but you don't need to understand the lyrics to understand what this album is about, because this is an album all about feeling. You know, great music makes you feel stuff, even if you do not understand the language. And Alces are great at singing with emotion, and it probably helps that it's the French language, because if they were like a... German band, yeah, <laughs> I, I wouldn't think it sound as beautiful as it does in the French. So uh, this album starts pretty, it starts more uh, with a more moving song with uh, Komorevi, uh, which I think uh, that song in some parts has more uh, faster elements, a little bit of black metal in it, but always beautiful. Uh, they had two singles, Le Envol, which is the second track, which is a, like an eight minute epic Peaks and valleys, you know, ebbs and flows. It goes through beautiful to harsher, but always goes back to the beautiful. Uh, I like the guitar tones on this record. And on this song, it's just mwah, beautiful. Uh, but you have a song like uh, Ametiste, which that one has more of the black metal elements. There's a part where it's, it gets harder, a little bit of more like rapid drumming. But again, it goes into beautiful, but that's basically the most uh, black metal song on the record. Uh, the other single that they have, Flamme Jumel, mm, great. That has a great like guitar part. It goes like ta na 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 ta na 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 And it's just a beautiful melody. And uh, the way Niche uh, sings on it is, is just so beautiful. This one has more of that shoegaze feel to it but feel like shoegaze mix with Enja. And you got the song, the sound of this song. Uh, then you have a palate cleanser, 
with Reminiscence, which is more of an acoustic track uh, with some piano and I think, uh, I don't know if it's a violin, and the lead singer and they have a woman singing, they just go, they go like this. Ah, 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 and I'm like, I'm like listening to this and I'm like, Alcest, you are touching parts of my soul that I didn't know could be touched. It's just such a beautiful piece of music. Uh, they don't even need to sing. They just need to go, ah, ah, and it's just... It's just great. It's beautiful and it goes great into the last two songs of the record, which is Le Enfant de la Lune, which I think it means the infant of the moon, and Le Adieu, which is like goodbye. And Le Enfant of the Lune is a huge track, like a, almost eight and a half minutes. And it mixes all the elements that they've been doing on this album. You have the beautiful with the more harsher, but always like so inspiring and serene uh, and it's a it's one of the my favorite tracks beside uh flama jumel uh, i think this one is the second best track on the record uh and le adieu is more of like a softer song uh just them like maybe saying goodbye and you know this is a record that really it really plays with emotions you really you really feel happy or you feel at peace when you listen to this record even though uh, you don't understand French uh, you can connect with the emotions of music and that is the beauty of music you do not need to understand the lyrics to feel it if it's great authentic music it touches your fucking soul and that's what Alces does with Les Chances de la Aurore so again uh, French cultures, I love you. Uh, please forgive me if I butcher some of this because I, I don't know French. But I want to know from you cultures, what do you think of this album by Alcest? Uh, just put it on and let the music take you on a journey. And comment, what are your favorite tracks? And if you like the videos that I'm putting out, do not forget to give me a like. And do not forget to subscribe. That helps me with the YouTube algorithm to get to more people like yourself. So until next time, people. This is Hector, the shield dude on a couch, and I'll see you all right here on the couch. Thank you and goodbye.